guys, it's Roy from our local 12 at EpicDroid.com, and I'm here today with the brand new OnePlus 9, as well as the official OnePlus cases for the OnePlus 9. Now, before you guys get in too far, I will tell you up front, these cases are not cheap. This case goes for $40, this is their carbon fiber one, and then the sandstone one goes for $25, but they are definitely worth every penny. And even though that $40 and that $25 is fairly expensive, we do have something for you down in the video description down below. There's a link that if you hit it, it'll save you $10 off your total purchase of one or both of these cases. So first things first, the OnePlus 9 is a great phone. It looks great and it's one of those devices that you really want to show off. However, this thing is insanely slick, like there is no way I'm going to be able to use this phone without dropping it. Fortunately, OnePlus has these cases here that offer an amazing grip and are going to do a great job of protecting the device at the same time. My personal favorite here is the Sandstone, and I'm going to show you guys that one here first. I'll show you both of them, but I want to show you the Sandstone one first. To put this on, I recommend taking it with the slider off button here, and we're going to slide that in first, pop that down. Be careful around the volume button just to make sure you don't damage it. Presto, it's on and you're good to go. The nice thing about this case is it does have a super sandstone texture to it. So when you're holding this case, it is the most grippy case I have ever used. And that is no exaggeration. I've used a lot of cases, but I have never used any that are as grippy as the sandstone ones from OnePlus. As far as protection goes, you'll see here on the back, there is this raised lip around the camera, the flash, and the other sensors that allows you to set that down. And it does have a teensy bit of a wobble, but it's nothing noticeable unless you're looking for it. And you will see the same thing with the carbon fiber case as well. Here on the top, we have a cutout for the noise canceling mic. Come around to the bottom, we have another cutout for the regular mic for the USB-C charging port as well as your speaker. Here on the sides, you do have a cutout for the notification sensor, or the, I'm sorry, the notification slider. And as you can see there, it's super responsive, no issues getting in there, no issues using it. The power button, very responsive, no issues there. Same thing with the volume buttons over on this side. No issues there as well. Here on the front, one of the things I like about the OnePlus 9 is it is a flat screen. OnePlus 8 Pro and all these other devices that had these curved screens, they look amazing. However, they aren't very practical. That curved screen does add additional price to the device and it adds additional points of impact that are very hard to protect with a case. As you can see here, this case goes all the way around from the top to the bottom and then back up the other side here. That allows you to set this down and you can slide it around without having to worry about the screen getting scratched up. Now there is one little spot where there's not as deep of a notch, or I'm sorry, not as deep of a protective layer, and that is right here where you have this little notch right with the front facing speaker. That just makes it so that you can use the front facing speaker without your audio being muffled or distorted by the case. One other thing you'll see here is right around the corner there is this screen protector that is the OnePlus screen protector that shipped with the device, and you can see here that the case doesn't touch it, but you're never going to have issues with the case pushing up the screen protector and causing damage to that. So switching cases here, we're going to pop this one off and we're going to put the other one on. And as you can see there, it is a very tight fit, it doesn't come off super easy. But then to put the other one on, we're going to do the same thing, just slide it in here. And presto, we're good to go. Now this one here is a little bit slicker, it is a grippy surface, however it is not as grippy as the sandstone is. It has all the same features, you have the camera bump here on the back to protect the camera, then you have the cutouts for the noise cancelling mic, the USB-C charging port, the microphone and the speaker, you have another cutout here for your notification slider, no issues using that, no issues using the power button, and no issues using the volume up or the volume down. And the one thing I forgot to show you on the sandstone case is that these cases do both support wireless charging without any issues. As you can see there, starts right up, starts charging, no problems. So then the question remains, would I recommend these cases? And although I wish they were cheaper, yes, I would definitely recommend them. They are both amazing cases, they look great, they feel great in the hand, they do a great job of protecting your device and they are definitely worth the investment. When you're paying $800 or more for a phone, you want something that's going to be protecting your device in the best way possible and these cases are the cases that do that. So that carbon fiber look is definitely more of a premium look to it. The sandstone one isn't bad, however it does look a little bit cheaper when you compare them side by side. That being said, I prefer the grip of the sandstone one. It offers a lot more grip. This one offers a great grip, however the sandstone offers just enough more that I'm probably going to be 
using that one as my primary case. So again, I highly recommend both cases and we'll have that promise link in the video description down below. If you guys have any questions about the OnePlus 9 or about these cases, please feel free to hit us up in the comment section down below and we'll reply as soon as we are available. If you've enjoyed this video and if you want to see more like it, please remember to give us a thumbs up and to share it with your friends. And as always, just want to tell you guys thank you for watching, thank you for all your support, and you all have an awesome day.